<laughs> okay, on board the ship, um, there is a puzzle that we can do that we kind of neglected, and it's the ship's wheel. I was antagonizing you about this, but I think I'm down to, like, give you some hints. All right, but or, I want to try it. Or we could call Alex again, because maybe she'll... Uh, that's okay. Okay, so basically, I'm going to I'm gonna drop some sailor facts on you that you missed because you were skipping dialogue earlier. Was I? Anatomy of a ship. Do you know what a gunnel is? I've heard I've heard the word like man the gunnels and shit like that on all hands on deck. Uh, Basically, a gunnel is like the side of the ship, like that down there that you stick the cannons out through the holes. That's that's what it is, and uh, it is spelled gun whale. Gun oh. But it's pronounced gunnel because that's how sailors say it. Hey wait, did I already do some of these? Yeah you did. Oh it's saved. Yeah, like starboard, sunfish. Okay. Going well. Nice work. Uh, well, I'll let you keep on going for some of these, but I've got some more to suggest when you're ready. Okay. Is this road? That looks like a river. Oh, is it? I think oh, so. I see. Yeah, because it's cutting through the mountains. Well, I would. A road can cut through the mountains too. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I I think Sunfish is wrong, actually. Because I just remembered there's a part of the ship called the Bosun. B-O-S-U-N. Well, what here would be bow? Oh, bow. Yeah. We're kind of solving this together because I don't remember these solutions. So then what the hell is fish? Um, Fish Spring. Fish Creek. Fire Fish. Fish Fire. Fish Foot. Fish Rain. I don't know. Could be Springboard. No, I, I bet it's Starboard. Starboard's probably what it is. I thought we did Starboard. Yeah, but I was talking about the Spring. What to do with that? Oh. Um, Alright, you want another piece of Sailor trivia? Mm -hmm. The Foxel is kind of like the little deck on the back of the ship. And sailors call it Foxel because over the course of centuries they whittled down the word Forecastle. Oh. Alright. That one you get from Alex, and for some reason, like I said, dialogue in this game expires. You lolly lollied and didn't get through it. And so when we went to go talk to her, she didn't drop the sailor facts on us. Damn. Alright. <clears throat> um, Sorry, I'm not good at socializing. <laughs> Sorry about the dog downstairs. There's probably like a commercial playing right now with, having fun with another game. dog in it. Yeah. <laughs> He's cheering for Ohio State. Yeah. <laughs> So, the way that it works, if we trust everything else, is that the symbol on the outside wheel, that's the first word. Gun, yeah. whale, forecastle. Which means that we I was thinking this one could be soul. Oh, that actually makes sense. Soul stool, soul fish, soul flower, soul ball. Soul horse, soul bed. Maybe. Soul bloom? Where else do you think I could be getting this knowledge? The Is museum. Because I, I intended to check there a while ago in yeah. mind of this puzzle. You should go back to the museum and I can maybe help you solve that. I'm not sure how good I'll be. It's like anatomy of a ship. It's uh, that thing on the wall right there. The TV. Oh, shoot. Oh, that's right. I need to match each sail to its name. Uh, this looks impossible. Yeah, these are... Th okay, so basically... I'm wrong. This is not where we should go. Somewhere there is information that tells us how to figure all this out, too. I would I would think there would be a book over here. Oh, no. You know what it might be? It's a puzzle we already solved that I think is in our inventory. Um, it was in one of the first episodes. No. Not this. Maybe something in here that could help us. Not the guidebook. Not that. Not the music book. We still need to buy Ned a gift. Do we, though? Yeah, we do. A lot of people save up to buy him the sword. <laughs> really? Yeah, 9,700 kroner. We can do that. <laughs> yeah, I could do that for you if you'd like. Oh, here's some museum stuff. Sunstone. Wait, maybe that's not it. Sextant. Can I take a picture of this? Yeah, I'm not sure how much is important. Fishing reel, 
ship bell, sundial, cargo lantern. I'm trying to figure out what here Just in case. could be important. Astrolabe is cool. I've always liked those dudes. Um, canoe? Ooh. Skiprot. I want to visit here. Oh, I'd love to go to Iceland. Iceland is, I think I've said before, it is the number one country that I would get on a plane to go visit. I thought you said you were never getting on a plane ever again. I would get on a plane if it was to travel across an ocean. Because there's no way I'm getting across an ocean without a plane, practically. Ships are too expensive. If it was anywhere, like, on this continent, I would prefer to drive, because I hate flying. So, if you had to go to California... I would rather do a 53-hour road trip to California. I have nothing for you. Like, legit. You see, I mean, I figure if I'm doing a 53-hour road trip to California, then I'm going to cargo boat across the ocean this is another puzzle oh you know what i think there's some stuff on board the sh inside the ship that we can do now because i'm the same way i never hey, want to have to fly again doing? my bad way i went through the wrong cargo yeah planes are scary i'm i'm a land mammal uh a couple of leads we had in the cabin over here let me just see if i can remember them first there is a locked combination back here I think this is a relatively simple puzzle to solve, but I forget how you do it. Was it the instructions literally right there? Yeah, we had something. Numbers appear to show the number of touching sections. That's not it. Uh oh. Something had numbers. Never mind, I don't think we have the answer to this. Something will help us open that. I think that's literally just like a... This is what I was thinking of. Um. Oh no, can Nancy no, not was, let us- That was different. We did this already, didn't we? Yeah, but the words- I want to move this paper. The words underneath it are all sailor words. Like Gunnel and Focastle. Aw, oh, man. Oh well. Um, here's, here's a lead that we need to pick up on again. Let's read this. I have half the locator now. Tracing some faint markings at the top of the mainmast reveal the total sum of all four numbers visible in the locator holes. That means I still need to find at least two numbers to be able to locate the correct place to put the locator. So- Okay, do we have the locator? Maybe it's already upstairs. Oh, there it is, okay. So, the lock in my cores, the combination is tied back to tidal sounding depth numbers. When the locator compass is placed correctly on the chart. Okay, this is how we open up the thing in the cupboard. So, listen. Uh, the lock in my quarters combination is tied back to the tidal sounding depth charts. When the locator compass is placed correctly on the chart, four numbers will be visible in the locator's holes. These four numbers will open the lock when entered in increasing order. So that's it. We need to find four numbers. I have half the locator now, and I think it's this right here. Tracing some faint markings at the top of the main mast revealed the total sum of all four numbers in the locator's holes. So the number on top of the mast, I think it was 86, but we can go check. That's the total sum of the numbers. That means I still need to find out at least two numbers to be able to locate the correct place to put the locator. Another number we saw on the bottom of the mast, or the dock. It was behind the barnacles. Um, I need only to break this code to see which letters to pin. My search continues for a second number and the other half of the locator. Let's see. One number is hidden in Lawrence's antique map on the wall. That's right, we did, we did that. that. 14. 14. And then the other number, I think it should be in our notes, 26. So, if we take 14 and 26 and you add them together, it says that's 40, right? Holy fuck, she killed him. She killed him, oh my god. Um, erm. Um, <laughs> pay no attention to that. <laughs> I'm just gonna climb the mast now. Magnus's notebook mentioned this. The four chart numbers must add up to 86. Four numbers. Shit, I thought it was three. No, it's four. Okay. So. Wow, the town looks so pretty. So we put up the calculator. We got 14 plus... 14, 26. Weird pixels 26. over here. 
that is 40. So we need 86. So well, there's a th we need at least one more number to extrapolate what the and fourth then we'll one is. Get it. Yeah. I'm trying to think where that number would be. Um back in here though. Another thing, Toomey's dog carrier, there's apparently a key. Did we already do this? Hmm. Pictures of Magnus. It's fun to see his face. Aww. It is doggy. Mm -hmm. So 14 and 26. Um, oh! I think I need to get all the wooden sections pressed Did we down. never see this? No, this is a puzzle box that we have not done. Press down all the wooden sections. Oh. I hate puzzles like this, but I actually... That's a lie. I like them. I have a curse where I really like these kinds of puzzles, but whenever I touch them, I end up solving them in five seconds, and I'm sad that it's over. I, I noticed that I'm just doing the same thing over and over again. Stop! Do you okay. want me to try it? No. If I touch it, I solve it immediately. It's my curse. I'm like King Midas' touch, but my touch solves puzzles. There you go. I, w I was a little smart. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> Me. <laughs> it means long letters. If I only get to see you once a week these days, we better make a count. Remember what we talked about? This is good for us. Okay, I'll start. This week I booked an audio rep for the Ancestors Festival this year. Soren is, as usual, making it difficult, double checking every invoice and worse. He takes organization to smothering levels. I can tell he doesn't trust me at all anymore. That hurts, but at the same time, I can't help but wonder if there's more to it he isn't telling me. Seems protective to a fault. My old roommate Asa wrote from Paris. She sends her love to you. She's still doing the backpacking thing. I admire how free she seems. I don't think she'll be home for the holidays this year. Hopefully you will be. I want to finally put up a tree this year. Can we do that? Can we get a tree and decorate? It'll be all ours, just you and me. Isn't that cute? Love, Seita. Elizabeth. Fine, we can get a tree. No to decorations. Never decorations. I love this guy. The Limerick's book is coming along well. I think I'm onto something niche. Uh, but I miss Skiprot. I miss the dog and also you. When I return, I'd like to borrow the Langspiel from the Misty Skip. Longspiel. That's some instrument, I think. Vajia. Magnus, where's your sense of holiday cheer? And fine, I'll limit myself to two strings of lights. You'll like it once it's all done. I promise you always have. No, you can't take the long spiel out of the pub, love. It's great grandmother's, and I don't want it broken. What do you want the old thing for, anyways? It's just an antique. I doubt anyone's played the thing in years. Speaking of the dog, Tumi and I are on a classic war film marathon. <laughs> I watch for the plot, he watches for the horses. Oh river. my god, he's literally River. He jumps up, barking, and presses his nose to the screen whenever they run past. He's a cute one. I'm glad you let me watch him this time. Lots of love and kisses, Elizabeth. They hit split custody of the dog. Magnus seems pretty insistent over this long spill thing. Elizabeth, I need the long spill. I don't give a shit about your war movie marathon. <laughs> Please, I promise to take good care of it. I'll wait until the festival's over to have a look. I'm being quite serious. I love you too. Stay warm. Kvasia. How do we know that was actually him writing these letters? We don't, but this is before he went missing. So yeah, I, I guess. guess we can assume. Well, we could go investigate this long spill now. It's an instrument in the pub, apparently. Yeah. You should also check out the bottom of the ship. There might be stuff down there. Oh, he said when I return. That's right. So it must be him. Yeah. Damn, that's kind of sad, though. Hi, miss you. She, she's like, hey, we're not going to see each other. I'd like to still talk to you. Does he paint all of his letters with a watercolor brush? It's so bloody. It really looks like it. Yeah. Interesting font. Um... This is kind of this is kind of just sad to me. Yeah. He's just like, no, fuck you. I want your instrument. I'm not putting up Christmas decorations with you. I hate you. Uh, Magnus. I don't know. Maybe it's just like some kind of weird thing in the way that I don't need that that people communicate. This is the same model for Skyrim alcohol. This is. Alto wine. Where can an Inwa get some skooma in this joint? Actually, this is driving me insane. Can I pull up a picture really quick? <laughs> oh my god, you're right. That, I, I wasn't kidding. That actually might be a Skyrim reference. 
Guys, reference? Reference? I guys, can, I can reference? just put it on screen. Guys, guys, reference? Can you stop <laughs> being insufferable? No. <laughs> spooky, spooky. There was something in here. It was was oh, it a number? No, the flashlight is what we got in here. Although there could be more numbers carved into the ship. Yeah. The bilge is open? But why? Bilge. Oh, we're about to get killed. No, there's a fun word. Ah! What's going on? I was I was a bit too right about that. Uh -oh. Okay, stay calm, stay calm. I need to recreate the numbers written in the corner on the center dial. What? 15, 21, 21. Do you understand? Okay, so six. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's start with 21. I don't even know where to start with 21. Okay, well, two of them are 21, so that should make it easier. Yeah, I guess. Okay, now they're both the same. You're gonna want... Okay, so that's... Try adjusting one at a time. I can't understand math when I'm going to drown. I'm sorry, I keep on thinking of you reading about Franklin Rose and saying, Wow, he lived a long time. <laughs> okay, here's something that could help. In general, we probably want the bigger numbers to be in this configuration. Well, I figured the way that it was working was that the numbers are adding to, like, the totals at the yeah. bottom, but I couldn't tell what was adding to what. You're definitely right about Is it... that. Oh, wait, wait, I think I, I think I understand it now. I was being an idiot and thinking that the one that was, like, facing the nearest pump was the one that was getting chosen. Yeah. But it's the ones in the bottom. Okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. So... Try rotating that once. No, never mind. That didn't help. 13. Try rotating it one more time. This one? That one. Oh, you got you 121. Ooh, you're very close. That's 1521. Oh. The water stopped. You did it! The gate that was a total shut. accident. Help! Nancy! Are you alright? Watch if it just falls down and hits Nancy in the head. And she dies. Yeah. I knew we were about to get, like, <sighs> murdered. You had a premonition. <laughs> Someone's trying to get me out of the picture. That's an understatement. I heard a motor off the deck, but I wanted to make sure you were safe first. Looks like that was the right decision. Yep, you saved me. See? I knew we were going to be buddies. <sighs> Here. Whoever she did it. dropped this in the hold. Oh. Maybe it will be of help to you. Looks Definitely, like a, thanks. I could put that in I'm an bad at the not getting locked in things aspect of a case, but I'm really good at finding spots for mysterious objects. <laughs> Everyone has their gifts. Now the thing is, wouldn't she have seen whoever went in there? Maybe. That's up to you to decide. So Maybe there's secret exits on the boat. Maybe the culprit never left. You can ask her that question. What was that song you were singing? Are you spying on me? No, you were being loud. I'm not here to entertain you. With those words, it sounded like a love song. Just an old family song. A sailing song. My mother taught it to me. She passed when I was young. She sang often. I'm sorry to hear that. For what it's worth, that's something we both have in common. Then you understand. It's how I remember her. I'll let you go. Bless. Hmm. Hmm. Are I these know. lights up here before? Yeah. Those are the Christmas lights. Yeah. Oh, the, the, here is her two strings of Christmas lights that she was promised. Yeah. That her bitch boyfriend wouldn't <laughs> let her put up. You're team Elizabeth, aren't you? Fuck Magnus, bitches. <laughs> <laughs> In his dry ass letter writing. <laughs> mm. All right. I just want to go to the bar oh yeah that's right we can check out the long spiel we can also investigate the place where you were just attacked we could do that was it this thing it's one of these things i'll bet it's, it's that subtle, thing subtle but i see some differences in the halves of this pattern spot the difference do we just have to click on them mm -hmm. ah
So, like, does the difference appear here when I click it here? Yes. You have to find them on either side. I see. Is that... I meant to click this little thing. That's not in the other one, is it? You're right. Or it's not. Oh, no, wait. Oh. It's just the way that these wrap around. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not meant to be symmetrical. One, two, one, two, one, two, three. Just two more. Just one more. I think I see it. Jamie's stomach just made a noise. My stomach has been making the funkiest noises all day. Here it is. Good job. Whatever that is, what I is want it? a carved star. Hmm. We haven't talked to Gundar in a while. No, we haven't. Didn't he tell us to buzz off? Yeah, he gets angry sometimes. I didn't I didn't know we could touch these. Mel cello noises. Those are actually noises from Mel's cello in Waverly Academy. I was hoping it would be different depending on where we clicked on it. This is just like Kaylee's music taste on a Wednesday afternoon. <laughs> hey, girl! Good day. Why did you hit Soren? Hit Soren? He said you threw a bottle at him. I did no wailing, tailing thing of the sort. He's a liar is what he is, and he's trying to make old Gunnar look bad. He said it's not the first time this has happened between you two. We have fought before. I, but this time, he is a liar. Uh. Soren told me about your boat crash. He will pay for a wagon tongue. Who told me isn't important. Oh, my little fisker, but it is. Sorn is not one of us. He is an outsider, born ten miles away, a stranger. Ten miles away, and he's a stranger forever? Well, that seems unfair to Sorn. Unfair means nothing. You think because a culture is unfair, it will change for you? That is not the world. That is not Skipro. Goodbye. Goodbye. Be gone with you. I should dress up as him one episode because I have a sweater like that. He's literally Holt Scotto. He's literally Holt Scotto if he was born 10 miles away. <laughs> what was the other thing I meant to do? We can investigate the bilge. That's right. She usually no. This is a different Other spot. Other side, yeah. I have nothing for you, bitch. Bill just the other way. This Behind her, ship, like up the stairs. Yeah. This ship is annoyingly hard for me to navigate. Maybe you're just bad. I am. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. Glad we can agree. <laughs> can we use a slight switch? No, it looks like you could though. This is a real ship of Theseus, like Julian said. How much of the ship do they have to restore until it's not the same ship? I'm wondering if... The photos on Dagny's phone reference this wall. I'm sure of it. That's there's true. another number around here? No. I thought it would be like something we'd have to reveal. What does her phone show? I forget. Oh yeah, Dagny's still missing. That's right. That's right. Did we take a picture of it? Is her phone in our inventory? No, I don't I don't think it is. Mm. Is it? No. We looked through it. I just don't remember what we did with it. Oops. I wanted to <laughs> There's got to be something... Nothing in the bilge itself, I see. Something is up with that wall, though. Um, 
Maybe there's a hitbox on it that was really small that you missed. <laughs> Let's see. To the left, maybe? Are you just saying this because you remember there being something to the left, or are you- I you remember there being something here, but... <sighs> I'm not sure. What was in that box you could look at? Nothing? What box? There was, like, right to the... Those boxes. You can look at something here, but I'm not sure what. Was that just a sound? Not a real one. Hmm. That looks like something that would be important if you could see it. Yeah. Was Call there me. something here that we picked up before, like drawings? Maybe. Yeah, this might be where we found the flashlight, actually. Duct tape? Ah. Rope? Oh, these aren't just supplies. This is everything you'd need to kidnap a full-grown man. Bro, what if Magnus's dead body is, like, tied to the bottom of the ship and it's just been underwater for several days? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Why are you making that face? <laughs> Do we not get to take it? That's like evidence. Yeah, I think that's why we don't want to touch it. I'm going back to the bilge. <laughs> would Rusty this, would this lead to break? like below the water? Probably not. I don't like, know how where a bilge was it works. filling up with water. From there, yeah. I don't know how that happened. I wish we could go down here. I, I just want to see it from the heck of it. <laughs> This reminds me of Titanic Adventure at a time. I actually, I had so much fun with that game. It was such a goofy, janky, antiquated game, and I had the best time in the world with it. It was so funny. Nothing else in here? Nothing that we can do right now, I don't think. If this is the original captain's bed, Never mind. I should take a closer look. There was a note somewhere that said we should look at the bed. There are Venn diagrams. I need to place the numbers Great inside puzzle. the circle so that they add up to the totals within the overlapping sections. What a great puzzle. Oh! And we don't get any starters, okay. Well. Let's... Is there really anything we could say for certain right now? I don't think so. I'm trying to make sense of it. Let's say... Seven... And six. Oh, yeah, okay, I get it now. And that's 13. And then what plus 6 equals 23 anything? Oh, I think I see a, a big one. Hmm. 3 and 4. Then a 1 is here. And then a 9 goes there. Oh, let me remove these. Because I wasn't that certain about them. Oh, I guess I was wrong. Yeah, yeah, I was wrong. That 10 has a lot of overlap. It'd have to be a 5 if it was going to work, I think. Oh, I see. Actually, I don't. This is kind of... Your 7 and 6 were working. I guess they were. I didn't know if that meant they were right or that they were just working. Yeah, see? They were working, yeah. That just means working, not right. I don't know. You're close, I think. The whole left side looks clean. Say eight, two, and just switch some things around, maybe. Switch the six and the seven, and now throw that nine in. Well, what's adding up to twenty-three here? Is it the seven and the two? It's the seven, the two, and the nine. The seven, the two. Switch and the, the two nine. and the eight, maybe. Switch the six and the seven again. There it is. Score More drawings. Okay. Yay. That's nice. 